Hello everybody, Lost Frostbite here. This is episode 4 of The Walking Dead. Um, and this time I'm here with a guest. Hello. Umbra's here. And Umbra. Yeah. He's already gotten past this point of the game. But, just so you know, oh, stuff. I'm not quiet, am I? Halo said I was quiet earlier. You're fine. You might need to speak up a bit. There's like, what is that? Was that blood? Spooky. Spooky scary. Oh god, I don't want to have to go through all this blood. There's blood all over the place. There's a lot of blood. Oh, his parents came in here? What the hell? Oh, this is, this is terrible. First aid kit, though. That's good. You know, you don't want to scrape your knee. Shut up. First aid kit. I already looked at the first aid kit. We can totally move this. this to okay, I'm turning down the freaking music because it's loud as hell. No, not control. it like reset itself. Yeah, well, it didn't reset itself. It's just I think I'm gonna turn it off, or I'll turn it to one. It should be quiet now. Okay, back to the Damn. drama. I better not go out there. Why can't I go out there? Alright, there's literally nothing in here. Oh, there's a picture. I should probably look at the picture instead of searching the first Luckily, aid kit again. Nothing I need in here. Okay, picture. Don't be a picture of my fam. Is that my fam? That's exactly what I didn't want. <laughs> well, I knew it would be them. I don't even know. I assume that's them. Why would he rip it? That's them. Find anything? Shut up and listen. Okay. No, nothing. Just a picture, a photo of my family. They own the place. Yeah. It's a photo of the family who own this place. Oh, of the family. Might help us track down the keys to the office. Oh, don't tell me we're gonna find are. like his dead parents' body. You're Lee Everett. And we're gonna get the You're keys. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is oh, your damn. parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. Okay. I paid then. attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> I murdered Did someone. Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied Did to this you? place? Yeah. Oh. Uh, also, tell me if the there's plot and I need. The world is tell me if there's plot and I need. Oh yeah, plot. Shut up. If you don't think people will find any reason to turn on you, especially when the shit hits the fan, you're insane. Damn. Whatever. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good, because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. Oh, she's gonna kill me. I'll just keep it to myself. I'm gonna be dead. Uh, how can I trust you? I don't trust you. Thanks. How can I trust you? How can you? I trust you? You can't, I suppose. What the hell? Aren't you supposed options. to try to, like, convince me to trust you? With your boobus? Just kidding. Wink, wink. <laughs> wink, wink. Nudge, nudge. Alright, can I not? I can't look at the picture anymore. Um, let's, let's look at this palette. Oh, hey. No meshing of the A button to pick it up. Can I... Am I gonna use that stick as a weapon? Oh, is that like an axe? What's that? This is my dad's cane. Oh, it's a cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. What do you belong to? His sick? father. Nah, he was okay. I actually saw the shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Damn. Plus, he knew how to He's not gonna keep the cane? Like you would have. My dad gave it to me. See, dad just not like that. Okay then, can we go through this door? This door for when we found the keys. Oh. Better get this door clear, huh? Can Crap, game's like sure. glitching out of it, but it's fine. Okay, so um, bro, how how has video creating gone for you? Uh, terrible. I took a small vacation. You you took and, like and now we have like no videos. Yeah, I noticed. 
<laughs> we haven't posted good. anything no, in like since but Dying Light. Okay, here we go. But I'm sure we'll have some more stuff up soon. Oh yeah. Do you have kids? No. You Try and get some recordings of Halo on you guys. Mm-hmm. Um let's not talk about that. What do your parents do? Do you play sports? Let's there you not go. Talk about that. Do you play sports? Gotta be casual. I play soccer, but I you don't made really the exact like same decision? I'm not crazy about Is that either. really? Mm-hmm. All right, a little further. And then bam, zombie busts through the door. We all die. Zombie toilet. Toilet. Why do you want to talk yep. about your family? Do Spoilers. You hate you? Toilet is a zombie. Um, it's just complicated. No, not. It's just complicated. It is complicated. Why? It just is. But you love them, right? Of course. Yeah, of course. Who doesn't love their family? Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. Oh, do I tell her I killed someone? Um, uh, yes. I, uh, I, I got into a fight. What? He didn't even say it. What happened? <sighs> it ended really badly. After that, I wasn't allowed to talk to my family. Just That's tell her so you killed sad. someone. Tell her the truth. Let's move this thing. Tell her the truth. I'm surprised she isn't. Oh, and she's hurt. What was I about to say? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. It, it was bleeding really bad in that like three seconds we saw just her finger. I'll find you a bandage. There's a first aid kit right next if to you. If only there was a first aid kit right next to you. Yeah. Bam. That's gonna be like the hardest really puzzle to solve. I'll warn you, this door took me like a little while. I'm gonna keep looking. Around. What took you? Th just okay. this door alone? Yeah, there's like a puzzle. Oh, uh, there's a puzzle. Yeah, they're getting the pills in the back. <sighs> of course there is. Have a look. That, finger. that is really what? bad. That's, that's like a huge cut. Or that's just a lot of bleeding for Let's a cut. Get this cut covered up. Yes, please. There's one at the end of the chapter. Was what? That's really annoying, but it's just because I didn't see an item laying on oh, the ground. Oh, a puzzle? Yeah. Oh, uh, okay. I'm not gonna spoil it for you, though. Yeah. Okay. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? Your parents aren't coming home, they're dead. I don't think they will, they'll find us. They yeah, let's just be... Let's just be happy. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. Well, we should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case. Oh yeah, we still have those walkie-talkies. Stay close to me until then, okay? So you left the farm already, right? That's after the farm. Yeah. Who'd you save? Did you save Duck or the other guy? The Duck. Who'd you save? save? I saved Duck. I I don't think you'd be able to save the other guy. I feel like both of them would just die. Well, I tried to save Duck so I could get the tractor off of him. Oh my God! I tried to save Duck because he was a kid. Oh, I already listened to this. Um, there's nothing up there. Did I check this drawer? It's the remote to my dad's TV. The remote to a TV. Apparently, I need that remote. Uh, the keys are on that zombie out on the street. That's the door to the pharmacy. Okay. We should be able to find tools for that. So I need to there. I need to get the keys from the street. And uh, how's your finger? Everything seem okay? Have you heard I'm from Glenn? Keep looking around. I don't think I have to talk to Clementine anymore. Uh, I'm sure she's fine. Correct me if I'm wrong. Want to head back into the drugs? Probably. Okay. All right. I I Maybe. probably could have like. Oh, she's talking. Yeah. You're not bad, right? No, I just I, killed a man. Why would I be bad? Asking me that. Just kill that a man. Said you killed someone. Exactly. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? No, he was. It's complicated. No, he wasn't. No. He was having. Oh, oh, wait, you're a child. Was he bad? Yes, he was bad. Now let's leave before she finds out too much. Okay. She's asking too many questions. I have to put it on. Questions. All right. Um. Let's see, I gave him the energy bar. Oh no, she turned into a zombie. I had to kill her. Oh, that's a tragedy. Wait, what? 
she turned into a zombie and I had to kill her. Wink, wink. Who? Clementine. Oh. Wink, wink. Why are you wink, winking? No reason. Wink, wink. Stop. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to Hey, a radio. Here, let me have a look. It's probably going to be like missing its batteries or something stupid. Hey, no. Nah. This is Glenn. Who's and, Glenn? Uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your dad on the phone or on the talkie or whatever? This is Wait, we What's were in up? the middle of a radio thing. So I'm down at that motor in and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Oh, Glenn's one of the guys from the beginning of this place. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over. Wait, his name's Glenn, to too. You, all right? Oh, my God. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I could have made a terrible reference, but that would have been mean. I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast Perfect. as I can. Perfect. We're gonna go save him. That's what you want to do. Somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a job. I really hope we're not just gonna shoot the zombies, because that's gonna be way too loud. Okay, now back to this damn radio. It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. There we go. go ahead. Okay. Let's press the power. Nothing happens. Mm, nothing. Let's press the volume. Nothing happens. Let's press the back. Oh, yep, batteries. Watch. Yep. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? You know that there are no batteries. She's an right idiot. <laughs> yeah, of course. She's a reporter and she didn't even try. No. To to look at the batteries. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. She wouldn't know what batteries to look for. What kind of statement is that? Yeah. I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, uh, I just gave her thanks. food for no reason. Are you sure your girl doesn't need it? Oh. Uh, you should have fed mind. your child. Yeah, yeah that's what I made her fat. Take care of myself. Okay. And there are snacks all along the walls. Why am I over here handing out food? You gotta feed them so they get fat, and then if zombies come after you guys, you can outrun them. You don't her. even have to trip them. Grab the damn. Please be batteries. Nope, I don't know what it is, because it decided not to tell me. I don't even want to talk to Ducky. It's too much work. Are there just energy bars everywhere? Like, is there an unlimited supply of energy bars? It's a convenience store. Yeah, I know, but like... Here, take my energy bar. Here you go. Thank you. Of course. You took care of Clementine. Alright, now do we talk? I don't want to talk about your cut. Hi. Can I get you anything? Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Oh, well. Maybe I'm a little hungry. I just gave you an energy bar. Yeah, it wasn't much. How can you be hungry? I'll see if I can find something else for you. Do I have to give her another energy bar? I gave her a chocolate bar. Okay. Uh... Don't I have to talk to her to leave? Or do I have batteries? This battery should fit the radio. I do have batteries. When did I get batteries? <laughs> Damn it. They were on the shelf. Yeah, well, I found now I know that. Office, but I'm pretty sure the batteries won't fit. Wow, Sassmaster here. Yeah, these are no good. You're a pretty good shot. Okay, now how can we leave? Well, you don't fuck with a reporter. Especially oh, one she just used the effort. Last right. cup of coffee. Um, you ready to head ready out? To head there out? are children yeah. present. You? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Now let's, let's leave. This is gonna be, or I shouldn't even ask. Ooh. All right, all right. I'm kind of scared. What if we die? And you it's nighttime. It, of course, it's nighttime. Yeah. Oh God. There's one literally right next to her. Can't they smell them? They can smell them in The Walking Dead. Or no, they can't. They just they just hear them by noise. There they they hear them by noise. They sense them by noise. Did you see? I'm pretty sure. I hear people noise. by noise too, Nancy. I said sense. Whatever. I don't judge. Guys. Oh, 
Oh, hey. How are you here, people? Jesus, Glenn. How... Glenn hid in, like, the best place possible. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's oh, mission over. Oh, Better go back. No way. Hey, gotta go. Listen, oh, God. I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. And there's crying. It's a witch. It's a witch. Turn off the flashlights. I forget. Do you just, like, run past them? What do you do to a witch? Uh, you run past her, or you get a really good shotgun shell to her face. Yeah. There's an achievement for insta killing you. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her with or without you. Think about if it was you. He's saving her just because he wants to get laid. Okay, let's go. Memories. <laughs> Memories. I remember that part. Oh. Why is there a zombie just like kind of pushing on the wall? Oh, there's an axe by it. Okay, okay. We can do this. Okay, this is the plan. We don't know how hard it's gonna be to get her out of that room. Yeah, it's up. Look, there's an axe on the wall. No, don't tell me she's about to shoot. Yeah, exactly. Tell me if you get like stuck for a long time. Because there's one item that I, I literally just couldn't see it. The axe. Yes, Anthony, I, I couldn't see the axe that was surrounded by lights. Is it surrounded by lights? I don't know. It's like I can't see pretty it. out there. Can I not look over this truck? Can you die in this scene? Mm -hmm. Oh, fun. Alright. It'll play intense music if you're doing anything dangerous. Okay, we have to do something with the car. Or we can talk to Glenn, apparently. Oh, there's a screwdriver. Don't tell me we're gonna break the window. Hey man, that drew some attention. Be careful. Alright, just break it. Do it again. Oh, I guess we won't then. Are there any of them coming this way? I mean I did just try to punch out a window. Alright, can I look up? No, that's what it meant by look up. Can I keep going over there? Nope. <sighs> Alright, let's go that way. Hmm. <laughs> and we're back where we started. Alright, um, can we... Oh, we can run all the way over there. Jesus. How long can a zombie feast on one dude? Like... For reals. Okay. Your survivalist. I'm not sure I can take the bullet on myself. Um, I need the. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I hear the heartbeat now. Suck to come. A little naked out here, except for Carly's gun, and we can't use that much. See, there's an arrow over there. But... Is there nothing I can do? Nope. Not by this car. So let's go all the way back. Okay. I thought I explored all of my choices, but apparently not. It's okay. Okay, what's under this? Is that a pillow? Good luck smothering them to death. really what I have in mind. Oh, I'm gonna throw the pillow as a distraction. Okay, you already you're already doing better than I did. I could not see that pillow. I thought it was scenery. Well, I saw the little thingy by it. What the hell am I gonna do with the pillow? Five, six, seven, eight. Do you have like the HUD and hinge turned off? Really want to get into the uh, room. I don't. I th like I when, have the HUD on. Like, like when you make a decision, does it go like so and so will remember that? Yeah, it does that. Okay, yeah, you got all that stuff. Okay, can I break I it, it with the pillow, yeah, or am I gonna smother the window. or smother the window? You're gonna smother the window. Yes. You're gonna suffocate it. Uh, just, just let me do it. Come on, Glenn. Come on. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. I still can't punch it. Um. Let's see. Maybe we can just smother that one. 
Just follow my lead. Oh god. Stay right behind me. Uh what the hell? How okay, how does shooting a gun sick. into a pillow make it make no noise? It's a silence. That makes no sense. It's a silence. That makes no sense. It's a silencer. Sense. And I know this is terrible, but I have to end the episode here. Um, so I'm gonna end it with me grabbing the spark plug. After this dialogue. Or is he just gonna look at it? He's... Alright. So, everybody, that was episode 4 of The Walking Dead with your host, Lost Frostbite. Um, we also had our guest host. Umbra. Umbra! And uh, I'm sure he'll be back on here, like, a few more times while we play. Because he's also playing it at the same time. Not at the same time as me, but he's playing the game. So, if you enjoy our channel, subscribe. Uh, we will be making content. I will be posting Walking Dead episodes every Tuesday and Thursday. So, I'll see you next time. Goodbye.